Grand Theft Hate from Brazil. Keep it metal. Yeah! yeah! My name is Marcelo. I play guitar. I have 45 years. My name is Pedro. I'm the bass player. I have 21 years and I also am in the role of back vocals and screaming vocals. My name is Priscilla. 25 years. I'm singer. My name is Marcio. I'm the drummer. 42 years. No more professional way, no yet. Yeah. For me, I play several concerts with Odo. Last year, I played in the night with a friend of mine, Diego, in bars, clubs, and uh, that, that kind of stuff. I played with Marcio in my storm. Uh, I have a pop rock band also. I have a jazz band, a uh, jazz confusion band. We play some jazz, old jazz tunes like. Uh, like the uh, uh, pink cobra, that, that, that kind of stuff. And I also played with uh, Alice Mesquita some et ethnical music, some French music, Italian, even some Borna from Africa. Yeah, I, I played a lot, a lot of stuff around the years. Um, my, my first experience with a band, a band in a more professional way is that stage. Yes, Dark Blue is my, my classic rock band and my storm is a proggy metal band. Can you play with me? Yes. <laughs> my family influences and listening to music in general yeah, for me, it's a kind of funny story. When I was around nine years old, I threw my backpack in the school. Uh, I was a kid. And my dad, uh, he, he punished me and, and, and left me with, with our video games and computer for, for like four months. Because the, 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 the boy broke his, his arm. And in that middle time, I learned how to play bass because my dad was a was a, a bass player, and I I bugged him every single day for he teach me, and he, he taught me, and it is what it is now. Uh, when I followed my brother into church when I was a child, some people invited me to sing in a band. But the band had no drummer, and I went some goods. Didn't left it anymore. Yes, we always had our feet for music. A band was formed in Guadalajara, and all the members lived there, with the exception of Pedro. <laughs> the band was formed in the mid 90s and was consolidated in 2009. Traditional heavy metal. Yeah, but we have influences since blues and old rock and roll but with a new age, new school kind of vibe in tones, even briefish and so on We have as inspiration our idols because they are mirrors of what we wish to accomplish someday We usually do rehearsals at Toca dos Banão Studios here in Santos, but we met each other every week to discuss some other issues that are not always about rehearsing.
Yeah, we write our songs in English because we have the objective of not playing only in our, on our country, but throughout the whole world, maybe in the US or Mexico, whatever. Yeah, we all have that objective. But we are recording our songs with the goal of spreading our work throughout the world. And we have enough material for two full length albums. And we hope some label that interested for what we do so we can have a greater support. Our musical taste, for sure. Yeah. Our songs address various subjects, such as a human behavior and social contexts. In the teamwork, usually Marcel gives us the raw material, and each one of us just put, put on the influences. The lyrics are made the same way, he gives us the idea and we work on it. the music. We usually write in each other's house or in a studio. English. We have a pub of all ages since a teenager or old school rock and roll fans. No, we don't. With this formation at Blackmore Bar in São Paulo. In Santo André at the center of the bar. We didn't play any gigs this year. We are totally focused in recording our material. Anywhere in the planet where a headbanger soul. Yeah! yeah! As soon as we finish the record, we make it available for sale. At the moment, we have five songs that can be acquired individually. Our songs are available online in the links in the description below. Below, right here. Good, right here. Right here! It's a natural process. We really enjoy the physical material and miss a lot the album booklets, but the technological marketing has made go on to form it that exists today. Previously the record was the end product of sale and the shows were to disclose. Now the roles are reversed. Thus, make the shows the final product and CDs for the dissemination product. Your work is very important because that space that you give to your bands to show their, their work is awesome, it's phenomenal. And even if you stop to think about it, even the greater bands, the famous bands, had start from somewhere. And the new cycle of things that new bands coming up, getting their spaces, it's necessary for the music itself to survive the, the ages. Yeah, any material if well recorded, well played, is never a waste of material, you know? We believe that everything had, had its chance, well, well done.
I had as I um, in the mall with Jeff Hanneman, Slayer, and Frank Zappa. For me, I really love the job of Aldi Miola. The guy is a beast. And Victor Rutten, I guess, is also a very fancy best player. I really, I really love him. I'm more into the jazzy stuff, not the metal. Ah. But I really love Tosina Basi and Misha Man, so that new kind of vibe, the more metal shit. I have a title, Chain is a Bring, Hub Halfer, Deal, uh, Job Date, and Wilson. I have a title. I have a idol. My father, Mike Portnoy, the bridge, but the rich. Yes. so their life becomes easier. Uh, to build a reality, you must have a dream and a mold. And, a, and they are mold in which people are inspired. I guess in both cases, especially in our case, because you see, I play with two guys that are way older than me and I'm the newest guy in the band. And I guess the influence of music, of new stuff for me and for them, and them with old stuff for me, is pretty important in our compositions. Uh, for example, if you take the song Save Me, and you, you see that I have that heavy kind of bomb stuff, stuff, but it still maintains that old kind of vibe, that, that old school kind of vibe. And I guess that's it. Get the series members with the same idea, the same music purpose, and with great faith and perseverance, even though the path is not easy, even because we don't not have a financial conviction that fully makes possible our work. believe in your own potential and, and still work to achieve their goals. Yes, rap to 50, new song to be released. Through all websites, or social networks, or mail in your gigs. We'd like to thank you, Robux, for the space that's given for us to show a little bit of uh, our work, our poor English, sorry. <laughs> but yeah, I'd like to thank for all the fans of the band, all the possible fans that we can get. Our work is only possible with you guys. Without it, we are kind of nothing. Just a band playing in a room. That kind of sucks, now. And I guess that's it. We, uh, so, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.